All right, it's the Battle of the Boxy Charms. Subscriber box versus review box, which is better. So I have two Boxy Charm base boxes, um, and I'm gonna unbox them both, and we're gonna see which one has the better box. Um, so this one is my subscription box. This one is the review box, and we're gonna unbox them both, see what they both, um, which one's better. This one, weighed I believe two pounds I don't remember what my subscription box did so check it down um, below to see um, if you can tell which version you got so we're gonna start with the review box it's 25 boxy charm is $25 a month for the base box they also have boxy charm premium and boxy Lux. boxy Lux is quarterly um, and I do subscribe to that one as well I do have BoxyCharm Premium on my channel for February if you want to check that out. Let's see what I got. So, I received version C2102007-BA. That is my variation. Um, let's see. First up, we have Saturday Skin. This is the Yuzu Vitamin C Sleep Mask. Um, it's a lightweight mask that works while you sleep to deliver moisture while targeting the look of aging, dullness, pore, stress, and texture. This unique jelly texture mask is crafted with the Yuzu fruit, which contains three times more vitamin C than any other citrus. Retails for $29. Nice. All right, and then we have, this is the Tristique Eye Duo Good Vibes Mascara and Eye Pencil. Um, retails for $44. So it's a combination mascara and eyeliner. I like the mascara and I like the eyeliner. Um, the curler just is, I don't love that. I don't love the curler. So maybe it's just, I haven't figured out how to use it. If you like the curler, if you have any tricks, let me know. I just feel like it's too skinny. Like you're like separating your lashes trying to curl them. I don't know. I use like a big eyelash curler because my lashes stick out straight if I don't do that. So have that. And then we have the Glamier Pink Lux Glitter Eye Brush Collection. It's $29.95. I do have one opened here. So little glitter hearts like metallic V hearts in there. They're really cute. I like this set. Then we have the Wonder Beauty Getaway Palette. I think I actually customized with this, so I'm thinking it's in my other box too. It's $36. It's a really nice palette. So this is my other one I have. That's kind of the colors. It's just a nice everyday palette. That's what I use it for. And then we have St. Lux what is this? Beauty Limited Edition Liner Duo. Retails for $40. Let's see what we got. Okay. So we have Secret Admirer and Love Letter. I'm going to do swatches real quick and I'll be back. Okay, here's the two little swatches. I just want to see, show you, you know, like how fine the pencil is. Pretty neutral shades. And that is everything in my review box. So, pretty nice. Um, I like the Saturday skin. That's my favorite item by far. So, that's everything in the review box. Let's move on and see what's in my subscription box. So, here's my subscription box. I received version C2102010-BA. So, I'm not going to show you the brushes again because we've already done that. So, we got brushes. I got the Tula Skin Care So Poreless uh, Deep Exfoliating Blackhead Scrub. This one retails for $32. And then we have... The Beauty Crop Cocoa Gold Mist, $14.99. It's a hydrating fine mist, envelops skin in moisture, and helps set and refresh your makeup look. 
Coco Gold Mist includes a delicate amount of gold pearlescent shimmer that imparts a radiant glow while boosting hydration. So I'm going to unwrap this and I'm going to spray it on the back of my hand and see what it does. Okay, so here it is and I'm going to try to spray it on camera. Shake it up and you can see the gold flex. So hopefully this doesn't make a giant mess. I'm going to spray it like not in my filming area just so I don't make a mess. Okay, so I don't know if you can tell. There you go. You can see it now. So it does give a good amount of gold, um, like little shimmer and flakes to my skin. So I don't know. I probably would use this more as a maybe a body glitter type of situation just because, you know, if you're not really young, adding like glitter and stuff to your face can kind of make you look older so I probably won't use this on my face so next up this is EVIO Beauty Pore Perfect Primer retails for $23 it's a primer with a matte finish that creates a smooth base for your foundation and helps it last all day nice and then, I believe this is my item I customized. Yeah. Um, this is the Brow Bar by Rima Bombshell Brow Kit. Retails for $40. It says it's the golden goddess of all brow kits. It contains tweezers, a brow pencil, two sided spoolie with brush, highlighter, concealer, and two shades of brow powder. So let's take a look. Here is that, and there's a button here in the front. Okay, I had to kind of figure it out off camera first. So, push this, this pops up, and there we go. This is nice. You have the pencil, the spoolie with the brush, and then there are your colors. Nice, so there's like a dark brown and a black. It looks really nice. All right, and that is everything in my personal box. So uh, let's recap. Um, we have the brow kit, the spray, the brushes, the um, scrub, and the primer. I do like my box. Let's bring in the review box. So head to head i'm not really sure which one i like best i really like the brow kit i mean i picked it so clearly that's the one i wanted um this is my favorite item in my review box for sure um brushes were the same in each the only thing i'm not crazy about in each is i don't love this um the actual curler on this product although I like the mascara and I wouldn't use like a setting spray with gold in it on my face so there's kind of one item in each that I'm not loving but overall I mean it's for the price you get a great deal uh, with products so I, I really I would lean towards the one I selected just because I really wanted that brow kit but it's um I don't know. I really, I think they're pretty much even as far as the boxes you get. And from reviewing and getting uh, multiple review boxes and subscription boxes, I have not found that they consistently give, you know, the reviewers the quote unquote better boxes. Um, I feel like it's just random because I don't get the same review boxes as other reviewers. Um, Sometimes. Sometimes we have the same box, sometimes we don't, but uh, generally I feel like it's kind of random what, like they'll just pull a base box somewhere to send to reviewers. I don't feel like they've curated anything especially for us. That's just in my own personal experience. I think BossyCharm is a fabulous subscription. Um, it's one I personally spend my own money on, 
um, even though I get them for review, I personally um, spend my own money on the company. So I can tell you just from my own personal experience, even if I never got a review box again from them, I would still subscribe because I love their, their company, I love the makeup I get, and I've been happy with them. So, um, if you want to subscribe, they have Boxy Pop-Up where you can get beauty products at a discount. They have lots of different things that they do. Um, you can do add-ons on your box. So check the link down below if you want to subscribe, if you want to get BoxyCharm Premium or Luxe. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.